Wars. If you're a member of Naifu's Nation, you can win that online tournament and get to go to the Congo Saga for free and some money too. Oh, so Cal Rising, man, we're coming back. Yeah, so it, I think Larry was already automatically going, right? Yeah. So Lumbre oh, got Lumbre. another spot. Lumbre right. got another spot. Hey, yo, shout out to Lumbre. Yeah, man. Lumbre doing I'm, really good. He is. He is, dude. He's on the big come up. He he's looking to make sure he moves up that PR spot several spots. He's he definitely is considering he's been doing so well. And you know got, what's been doing so well? He's got a so win well? on Void, who's se third, second, second, second. Yeah, it's uh, Void Elegant. Yeah, so Tri-State Showdown. Showdown. Working with Collision up there in uh, New York, Shouts New Jersey to East area, Coast. Tri-State. Shouts to East Coast. I'm not gonna be there, but from what I heard, uh, you Z-Fly will be there, man. Z Flight's gonna be. You there. will be there. My Flambo will be there. Oh He'll yeah, be there sorry. For you. My uh, East Coast counterpart. <laughs> and then we have Genesis Bog. We're also partnering with Genesis to give another six match ultimate tournament. Man, you guys have two good, like, at least minimum B tier events yeah. on the same weekend. Yeah. That's I'm telling you right now, get that multi Twitch. Get that multi Twitch. Hit the sub button. And you'll never make the same mistake you've ever made again. I'm telling you, man. If you have Twitch, you have Twitch Prime. And you get that free sub. Give it to us, man. I'm telling you, this, this next weekend. The reason to make sure you sub. Anyways, Cosmos versus MK Leo. Cosmos on the W. MK Leo holding the L because I, if I made that right, MK Leo does have an L in the name. Yes, lost to Larry with uh, Marth in winners. Now he's going Lucina. I wonder if he's been going all Lucina. In losers. I feel like he is. He's he talked about like secondaries and stuff like that. So now having to win two sets off of Cosmos, I mean. I would love for Cosmos to, you know, clutch this out, getting the win over Leo. But oh, that yeah, was a Leo, good option. Lose back at Leo, even in lose in uh, local tournaments, is uh, is scary. But dang, look at this edge guard from, oh, from Cosmos. That man, Excuse me? That man lost well, the what jump. What the heck? He, was he said, he said, who's out here spreading words? I'm leaving PG. Man. Who who said this? What the heck? Is that real? Someone said that? Man, Twitter, man. Twitter, oh, Twitter's man. wild. <laughs> Twitter, Twitter's a whole other level, man. He's right, just telling that's everybody. That's clearly a lie. Yeah, anyway. exactly. Did that stuck the Leo lost, man? It's proving a point. All right, anyways, Mars, I'm sorry, Cosmos. I'm out here mixing up names. I mean, Cosmos making you sure. You got the wrong panda, dog. I do got the wrong panda, man. The right panda, though, is making the right moves here. But oh fortunately, MK Leo made sure this, go this boy got got. Dang, I saw, I mean, that's, that was so cool and all, but I just get reminded of when he did that to Esam <laughs> with his uh, Marth at, at Summit. It was way more cool because he got the tipper F smash. But, he you know, did. It's, it's fine. That, that was hot. Pretty hot kill, kill confirmed that Lucina can do too. And um, I think we're going to see more of uh, Leo doing this matchup, honestly. Uh, from what he's said in the past, though, he really thinks Joker doesn't do that well for Zinkling. But oh, oh uh, yeah. Scoops him up better with the up smash. Free roller, up smash. And you the, already know. The thing about up smash too is that the starting hitbox is from the feet. So if it doesn't connect, you will not get sent up to the middle hitbox when it actually kills you. So you have to, you can actually, like, if I'm not mistaken, you actually, if you get hit by the weaker spot of it, you can DI away. That's good to know. Yeah. It's very similar to, like, how Lucina's own smash works, basically. Oh, okay. Yeah, that makes yeah. more sense. Trying to hunt the landings here. No, now we'll get a decent juggle. And I'm starting to see Cosmos get away with, like, these uh, mid-range dash dance. Just kind of bait his uh, approach. Not make it too obvious when he's going to go in for the dash trap. Oh, good oh, parry. Yeah, good parry. It's uh, not too difficult to parry um, like sword characters. Like, if, if you know their rhythm when they're going to do like a falling aerial, you can get some easy uh, shield grabs on that. Oh, no tech. Yeah, but Leo does oh, not follow. Oh, good delayed aerial but too, but there's the upbeat. Double slash out of uh, the roller attempt. I don't blame him for going for it because if he gets that roller at this percent, guaranteed dead. Mm -hmm. Good side beat. Gets, goes for the downward uh -oh. version there. Gets Catching percentage. The oh, man. He caught all this man's jumps. Not even letting him touch the ground. Oh, yeah, this is a big percent for Leo. He now, I think F smash after the ledge. Oh, that was a good reaction wow. there. He knew that Leo was going for that side beat. He just reacted positively. He caught Leo's spot dodge. For that. Yeah. And like I told you, right, the, the hitbox comes from the feet and it sends you upwards. I mean, it was a good opportunity for him to finally catch MK Leo. MK Leo was playing a game with Cosmos where he told him the, fl the floor is lava. Don't touch it, man. Yeah, it was one of those situations where like you have a good lead and like you're starting on really strong, but then the momentum is slowly slipping in your opponent's favor, and mm -hmm. you got to like immediately, you know, in the game before you, you just get come back on. You know what I mean? Yeah. But first game of the Cosmos, only needing two more wins to be the winner of MSM. I think this will be like a second. Time yeah, win yeah, yeah, MSM. yeah. It will be a second time. Uh, yeah. 
He did all the grind, man. Yeah, good. Uh, that's what I want to see, dude. Honestly, Cosmos is a player of a really great caliber. And my favorite, personal favorite thing about Cosmos is he actually always switches all the Inkling colors because they're yeah. actually all pretty good, except one of them. But we'll talk he, about that color. He uses the good Inkling colors. It's that's all I'll say. Yeah. <laughs> he uses the best ones. You know, if he oh. was really, if he was really, you know, meta, he would counterpick the Inkling colors to, like, blend in with the stage. Like, he would pick the green one on this stage, so, like, oh, you can't see yeah, anything yeah. that he's doing. I mean, you can still kind of see it, because I'm more of a neon, oh, but, oh, damn. excuse me, man, where do you DI the down smash from? That was actually a really good tech chase in general. I, I still don't see that many uh, Martha and Lucina players abuse that when they get tech chase from down tilt. Just run up and get the immediate down smash to catch tech in place. And with Lucina, it's even stronger, because... You don't even need to be, get the tipper down smash to kill. Mm -hmm. Right oh. now, though, it's looking like the Leo show right here. Oh, yeah, getting another perfect parry on that roller. Oh, oh my god, Nair, Nair 1. Yeah, delayed Nair, 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 Nair 1. That's what I think MK Leo likes to do, too, also. He likes to delay his aerial, so it kind of like fakes out his opponent. Like, oh, he's not going to go for fair. Then you drop your shield at that one second when that aerial will counter the most. Yep. Oh, tech. And he, oh, man, Cosmos had the right idea, but Leo oh. was on. He's out point. of here. That force, that force there looked like it should not have killed, but we take those all the way to the bank. And now Leo is giving these crisp juggles. Already at 27%. No stock taken. And it's like, Mitchum has not left his hand at all since this game started, honestly. This is looking pretty rough. He got the up throw up there. Oh, Still yep. Connect that percent. Finally getting the stock for himself in the game here, but. Kyle's oh, no, probably asked himself, like, man, what am I doing? Just up throw up there. Well, why am I wasting time playing neutral? I already, I already got him at the percent. Time to get the kill and bring, thing, bring things back. Yeah, it's not impossible. Inkling damage output is some of the best in the game, especially when you get your opponent all inked up. Yeah, jab, man. That rapid jab just <laughs> yeah. makes sure you're covered in nothing but ink. Yeah, that jab have potential to do like 30 plus percent. Yeah. Kind of crazy. Nice tech. And I really do like the delayed dolphin slash Ooh. 2 to edge guard from Leo. Ooh. Oh, man. Cosmos is keeping everything oh here, man. He's Hanging on by a thread, honestly. Like, Leo <laughs> had so many times he could have killed him. Man. That man is on life alert percent, man. He already pressed Get the button, and here. MK Leo said the ambulance is here. We'll put it at 1-1. One, one. Nice. Super hard adjustment from Leo in the second game. That's kind of crazy, too. Like, Not to just, you know, super hype up Leo, but... I it's like, even when he loses really badly in one game, he just comes back like he didn't even... I, even you know what's funny, too, is that game one, even though Cosmos won it, like, slowly MKLeo was coming yeah, back. That's true. You already saw that game one there. Game two, MKLeo demonstrated what he was going on through with game one. Three, two, one yeah, that was pretty solid go. two stock there coming out from Kaleo. Oh, I don't know if that roller was intentional. Like, I, I feel like it was yeah. Start out the game with a <laughs> roller in neutral. That's some ambitious stuff right there. But yeah, this is a good counterpick for uh, for Cosmos here. I love the middle platform for these up throw combos. It's going to make it a lot easier to get follow-ups. And he's been getting a decent amount of grabs on Leo in the first place, so he'll be able to get a lot more percent if he plays his card right in this stage. Grabs the ledge. Gets that man with two slashes and then puts him way off in disadvantage. Oh, Great. perfect punish on the upbeat. Hitting the stage there from Leo. That was so good. Yeah. And at that moment, Cosmos thought he was going to land safe from that man. Kaleo told him, there's a reason why I'm delaying my aerial so much. Yeah, he was just maneuvering himself around where he would land. Oh. But, oh, my goodness, another one. He had uh, the right option, but M. Kaleo made the spot dodge at the right time. Yeah. Last time, oh, wow. Oh, okay. The Nair to hit him out there and then just immediately catch his jump up there. That was actually really good awareness from Cosmos. That's exactly what he needed, too, to not let Leo build on his lead too, uh, too much. Mm -hmm. Nice. Cosmos chooses a great landing option there. Tries, doesn't try to go to the middle. He kind of goes more towards the ledge. Okay. So far, man, both players immediately try to see where the commitments are lying at because Cosmos is using that spaced back air. Just trying to poke in the percent. Yeah. I really like how Cosmos is facing the neutral right here. He's not giving anything to Leo for free. Yeah. He's making sure if I'm doing damage, I am well enough off to actually get away from him if you try to react or if you're going to parry. Oh, man. He tried to delay it too, but unfortunately got caught. Oh. I would love to see uh, kind of, Cosmos kind of like do some more like, empty hops to bait out these spot dodges from Leo and then try to get some guys from there. Is that oh, okay. I was going to say the initial start for the up, he actually might have messed up MK Leo, but like you said earlier, right, man, he holds his jumps. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But uh, yeah, Leo's been getting a, a lot of spot dodges on like Cosmos jumping, so if he can kind of bait those out, he can get some harder punishes here, in my opinion. 
And some of you guys might be saying, like, yo, man, Cobbs is playing lame out here. But unfortunately, I'm letting you know, man, he's playing optimal because he knows I can't commit to the MK layout how I've been doing these past two games. He's caught up to the game plan here and he changed things up. I need to be using these back airs. I need to be using these dash dances, which caused me to go to a like, super low profile. Oh. Yo, man, I need to use what I got. Rapid jab, nice. Solid ink, 125. And oh, Cosmos does get the aerial, Cosmos. but he missed oh, it. Oh, my goodness. Cosmos is uh. hard committed. Tried to get some crazy edge guard there with the up B extension, too. And Leo just took that one opening, turned it into a down air. Ooh. I, I love the use of Nair out there. He knows like MK Leo was going to go that low. He had to go for Nair there, but unfortunately, he missed it. Yeah, it's really rough. Now we got Leo with the stock advantage. Just tightening on all the percent. See if you can turn this offstage situation to an edge guard. That's what he's going to need here. Oh, yeah, nice. that was good. That was good. Go yeah. back for that fadeaway back air and you really get the stock. 53% of Cosmos games for MKLeo holds advantages in the cards. Honestly, all the, all the Cosmos need to get back in this. It's like a, a clean jab. <laughs> yeah. Oh, that was good. Look, using Slap Bomb, he caused MKLeo to hold shield by him enough time. Get this clean yeah. combo to 53%. Nice. That man is sticking outside Still the going box. Too. Ooh, he almost hit the back. I saw that. Yeah, very close, but Leo has some good space to get back to the ledge. But can he get to center stage here? Nice jumping over the splat bomb. Oh, he Ooh. trades so toughly in the positioning there because he went for a splat bomb anticipating Leo's option. Leo getting thirsty for the kill, swinging out that F smash. It's such an intense situation here, but there's the my dog's getting punished. Yeah, oh. and he doesn't even, he knows he won't be sent to a situation where he has oh, tech, but the delayed aerial. One. Air one F smash is going to kill. No and matter what part of the sword he hits you with, very strong option for you, Cena. Yeah. I mean, he checks. He checks the time. He's like, so you know what, man? Uh, you want to wrap this up real quick? Give me that. Give me that reset. So we can go home and eat some canes. <laughs> we actually are like waiting to, for Leo to uh, finish the tournament. He's like, he's like Cosmos, man. We're on canes. He's like Cosmos. We're on canes time right yeah, now, yeah, man. Canes don't stay open all night, man. <laughs> this ain't no weekend. That's a Monday. It's a working man's day. Yeah, man, well, you know who's going to work is Cosmos. He's definitely making sure he's trying to keep up MKLA. He was so close last game, dude. He yeah. owned, probably just one backer away if he had just spaced the right. But like I said, Leo loves those delayed aerials. We see it with Nair 1, and we definitely see it with sometimes where he stalls himself for a jump for a forward air. So Cosmos, he kind of had the right optimal play last game. Let's see if we can bring that back at the full circle this game. Yeah, he, he definitely made that game much more competitive than the second one. But look at some good oh. hits by Guy. Get him out of here. <laughs> he said, you back air him all the way to the blast zone. Don't even give him an opportunity to come back. He That's said, exactly we're playing eSports Smash Bros., ladies and gentlemen. I'm trying to make sure I'm in the game. That was great. That's exactly what you want to do to start out strong in the next game. And now since he has such a decent percent lead, he can start baiting out Leo to approach even more. That's kind of what he's doing right now. Oh, oh nice parry. Dude, that splat bomb is so good at conditioning your opponent's ledge options. He should be dead here. Oh, 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 oh okay, okay. And he said, I eject those seed on you out of there, man. Can't even come man. back on the seat. What a, what a great start for Cosmos here. He's going to take all the damage, too, because he's jabbing him at the mm -hmm. ledge. At it. Oh, oh okay. All right, Cosmos. All right. Come, come on, man. I mean, <laughs> you're, looking, you're looking nice, but Damn. <laughs> make, 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 make sure we win it out here. Don't go hey, a I don't too blame far. him, man. That's one way to, like, turn your opponent's, like, mental game. Oh, oh. You said you don't blame him. Oh, you you said you don't blame him. I I don't blame him. But you damn, said you don't I blame didn't him. expect him to down air him in the last one like that. Oh my god! But I'm telling you, last game Cosmos <laughs> Yo, had clean. so much going on for him. Right, he was just one back air, one one spaced aerial away from bringing it up against MK Leo, and then the last second MK Leo kind of caught up to that with a delayed air. So was, he brought that to full circle this game. And ladies and gentlemen, he said we're going to game five. That was clean. He like you do not get to jump off stage. You don't get to come back. That's it. And he said you can never even touch the stage. That was great. And now, game five. Cosmos mm -hmm. switching to the best inkling color. I don't blame him. You know, you want to close things out looking your best. You know? Number five from the kids next door. Easily the best character that's in that show. Anyways, let's get into this. It's a lot of good characters in that show, too. Yeah, they're all good. They're all good. Number five was my favorite. She was. She seemed like, you know, the second in command, like the real, the, the, the friend that keeps number one in check. You yeah. Know? I really like that about her character, her and number one's uh, friendship. But anyway, anyway. <laughs> yeah, let's go into this one, man. <laughs> let's see. It, like, they've been going back and forth. Like, one person wins dominantly, then the next person wins dominantly, then it's close. Like, I don't know. I, I can see Leo turning it up. Mm -hmm. But that first dive from last game, Kyle, oh, oh good my parry. God, what a parry on a shield breaker. You're a brave man. But uh, yeah, since Kyle's had that super strong start so much, uh, 
so much in the last game. It was very hard for Leo to come back and run a, you know, an offense. So I'm gonna say like whoever gets first stock is a. Uh, Probably win, honestly, just going by that trend of this match so far. Yeah, and that's how it's been going. But uh, Cosmos looking low on that fuel tank there, the inking, but he finally gets it back. He's got him killing oh. ledge. Good oh, use of the back air. Yeah, he caught the neutral get up, spaced it perfectly. And again, we have a situation where Carlos get the first stock, but drop mm. still on the dancing blade. Leo's trying to end this stock right now. Doesn't want to get uh, put in a situation where he's down too much. Oh. Yeah, this time Cosmos holds that shield just a little extra long because he knows what happened last time oh, when he did it. Leo mashing, trying to get this stuck out of here. But Cosmos is eating all these uh, attempts up for breakfast pretty much. Mm -hmm. He's like, yeah, you're going to give me these free punches. I'll take those all the way to the bank. Oh, he missed space in the back Ooh. air, and he tried to go for an air. That would have probably put MK Leo in a good spot. Nice. I like the gun from the ledge. You have to hold all the shield pressure. But yeah. Up throw with no rage? No, I'll, no, put, no. I'll put it on kill. Yeah, I'll no, put it on kill. Yeah, with no rage, no way. Oh, get oh. him out of here. And he actually upbeat the second that Inkling kind of reveals himself from the in squid form. Yeah, right when he um, got out of that low-profile dash, he immediately got upbeat. Good upbeat. It's not a phase. Like we said earlier, right? MKLeo loves to hold advantage. He doesn't stay in disadvantage for too long, and this is a really great demonstration. Yeah, he's just bullying him at the corner of the stage right now. If he Cosmos gets an back. opportunity, I kind of want to see him what he did last game. He go, he went for a splat bomb to cause MKLeo to hold shield and give Cosmos enough time, but the angle that he's being sent has become really difficult. Bruh, this is textbook ledge trap for you and Kaleo right here. Yeah. Oh, until he just gives him the ledge for free. <laughs> I hope that doesn't lead to Cosmos taking this dock. I mean, I mean, it might be the opportunity here because Cosmos is using that splat bomb. He tried to catch the spot dodge or the roll oh. get up. Good tech. Oh my goodness, Leo is calling out so many defensive patterns right now from oh. Cosmos, taking so much percent. Uh, Cosmos is right back where he was. And he's <laughs> gone. Yeah, he's gone. No he went to back go. to square one, dude. He had the entire stage to work with. Oh, that was good. That was good. I bombed oh. down smash, and he's okay. out of here. Got the slight charge on the down smash. Probably was just enough to get him to kill there. So now we're going to last stock. Cosmos one stock away from winning MSM, but Leo just wants to reset the bracket. He's been going so close. A good string up there for Cosmos. Back up to 40%, 40 getting another up throw. Oh, just carrying from platform to platform. Exactly what you want to do as Inkling here. Oh, since it's off stage, but I don't know about that dancing blade there. Okay. Just go for a B. Nice, catching that ledge jump again. Mm. Freaking Cosmos go. Oh, not able to catch the air dodge, but he's still getting pressured to the ledge over and over here. Yeah, being at the ledge has been pretty much so the big much demise percent. for Cosmos, but he has to go that extra low depth. Oof. That was close. Leo. That down air. Nice. He's finally able to come back, Matt. This man's got a whole center stage yeah. like he loses his life. And Leo's looking for that near one F smash, too. You almost mm -hmm. got it. But Cosmos yeah, had a clutch parry. Yeah, oh, he, did he, you see the grazing hit on the nair? And he so crossed like, up up, too. That's how you kind of switch uh, rolls oh. here. Oh, okay. I was going to question that roller for a second. Yeah, he wants the roller to close it out, but luckily Leo didn't punch it this time. For Cosmos, that is. Oh, Cosmos, nice. watch Narrowing yourself. Watch the landing here. Go, he has to oh. go back to the ledge because he knows he might get juggled. Oh, he's barely living the F tilt. Where is he going to go to get back to the stage, though, man? Look at all the pressure. Oh, oh good parry. Back throw. Brilliant parry to just to get back on the stage. Is he going to apply some pressure? Oh, no. You oh, traded the whole goodness. spot. Okay. Game five situation. Last stock. Oh, my goodness. The weak down smash sends him really back far off. Oh, he really missed it because he knows he was going to air it up. Oh, my God. Yo, this man. Close, but he dropped shield on that? I feel like that might have been shield poke almost. Oh, the second attempt the will cause it, back dude. Air. No reset. At the perfect time. Delayed it. Delayed his jump just to get the back air time 